guys. No, hey y'all, it is 7.51. As we see, I have doubled my move goal by 200%, period. So, um, it's 6.51, y'all. It is Tuesday, so happy Tuesday. When y'all are seeing this a video, it is... No, it's Wednesday. No, it's Tuesday. It's Tuesday. When y'all are seeing this video, it will probably be Thursday because I already got a video for y'all tomorrow. Um, if you're a channel member, you saw an early period. But anyway, y'all, it is Tuesday night. Just got off work. I'm home and I stopped and got a Target pickup. Y'all know I am addicted. When I say addicted, I'm addicted to Target pickup. So I grabbed a couple things that I didn't have that I need. I feel like I find something else I need every day. But anyway, I got some more salad because I have actually been thoroughly enjoying taking salad for lunch again so i got some hearts of romaine um this is one of my favorite salads my favorite salad or a type of lettuce is the butter lettuce but i got a bag of hearts of romaine i picked up some mild cheddar because it's babe's night to cook and he's doing tacos we typically do tacos every tuesday so every tuesday he know he's gonna cook so i'm mad because i should have did taco tuesday but anyway <laughs> um got some mild cheddar for tacos and stuff like that i ended up picking up some halo top ice cream y'all i love this halo top of vanilla bean um when i can't get my rebel uh, coffee chip i will get this halo top vanilla bean 290 calories per pint um there were 100 calories per serving a serving is two-thirds of a cup 21 carbs six dietary fibers this is per serving so yeah i always you know just be sparingly when it comes to halo top like i said my favorite is rebel ice cream sorry that was my dishwasher but my favorite is rebel ice cream but i also love this so i get this and then the protein what was the protein sitting there y'all protein was sitting there six six grams um per serving um i also picked up my favorite cookies they are the high key mini chocolate chip cookies one net crop per serving a serving is seven cookies which is awesome i'll put a picture on the side of the screen of how i like to eat this because i do combine combine this ice cream with these cookies and yeah i love it i do it this is like my little sweet treat if i don't eat one of those chocolate bars then i'll do this combo i'm a person that likes sweets so i definitely always need to have like a sweet treat on deck just in case um so yeah hello top ice cream high key cookies i also finally picked up some um iced coffee i picked up the stoke or the stock bright and mellow cold coffee macros right here three total carbs per 12 fluid ounces so y'all know babe bought this home one day and loved it so i got that then i also just picked up some tuna creations i got lemon pepper 17 grams of protein i got herb and garlic 16 grams of protein and then i got sweet and spicy now the sweet and spicy has more carbs than most so the sweet and spicy has four the herb and garlic has two and i want to say yeah the lemon pepper has less than one grams of carb and you get all that protein so yep just picked up these couple little things to get me um through the rest of the week and yeah it's taco tuesday so yeah i'm sure i'll come back and show y'all my tacos whenever i make them but yeah this is what i picked up how is y'all day going how y'all feeling it's hump day so well it's actually not hum day it's actually friday junior when y'all watching this so how y'all doing y'all ready for the weekend let me know below and i'll see you guys when i'm eating my tacos all right gang so like i told y'all in a previous clip babe's night to cook he did tacos y'all but i think i had told y'all like in a previous vlog that babe had challenged me to eat more whole foods and kind of cut back on the processed foods and also he challenged me not to use so many um well he actually said use none <laughs> low carb breads tortillas and things of that nature and i'm happy to report i have done really well so tonight y'all know i typically will use my low carb wraps i am using these lettuce wraps so i showed y'all these lettuce wraps in my previous video um these are uh, pretty big so i washed three of them two big ones and one small one just depending on how hungry i am but i'm gonna go ahead and load these lettuce wraps up i have to admit this challenge i didn't want to do it initially because i'm like i'm dirty keto i'm lazy keto but i actually feel pretty good really good actually um so i'm happy he challenged me to do that so 
I'm gonna go ahead and assemble my tacos. Y'all can watch me and then we're gonna eat. Also to drink, I do have some of this Diet Dr. Pepper. I haven't opened yet, so I'm gonna drink that. But yeah, get y'all a man to challenge you. And y'all challenge y'all man or woman back, period. <laughs> just finished working out at the gym um <clears throat> went to the gym closed my exercise ring so i'm so proud of myself i have closed my exercise ring six days in a row so i'm gonna see how long i can go um closing my exercise ring every day so i'll put on the side of the screen like all my completed days so proud of myself but anyway i'm about to make some coffee and walk out the door but before i do that i wanted to show you guys what i'm taking for lunch because i'm holding myself accountable so today is a wednesday and <clears throat> i was supposed to do turkey lettuce wraps but since i have so much salad i don't want it to go bad so i'm just going to switch that to another salad and then tonight i'm doing salmon broccoli and cauliflower mash so i am using my aldi bowl y'all this was called a salad bowl or salad organizer from aldi um it's not there anymore <clears throat> but that's what it's called and like i said it it's this size now but when you're done using it you can push it down and it's just really really small um so yeah i just got some lettuce the lettuce that i got from target i think i showed y'all earlier in this vlog um i am going to also take this tuna creation packet i showed y'all this as well has less than one gram of carbs 17 grams of protein period um then to drink i'm just taking my favorite peach mango green tea this is my favorite green tea it's the one from um walmart and it's the peach mango green tea but the grape value one the grape value one is bomb so i'm gonna put this in my lunch bag a bottle of water obviously and then for my salad toppers i am going to be bringing some of these crispy onion strings with seed and they're seasoned with garlic and black pepper they are three um carbs per one and a half tablespoons so i put some of them in here and then also the bulk of what's in here are bacon bits so i had a little bit of bacon bits left they're all gone they're all gone now um i just put the rest of the bacon bits in here and this is going these are going to be my salad toppers i skipped on the um crispy jalapenos today and i'm going to try these so that's why i like to do salads y'all because you legit can eat salad every day i can because you can switch the tuna you can switch your dressing you can switch the toppings like now when i go on lunch all i gotta do is put my tuna on my salad and my toppings and i'm just gonna get me some dressing um so i think what i'm gonna do is go ahead and put the top on here put my toppings here um put the top on it and then i will get my little dressing container and put me some dressing in here so i'll be back when i make my coffee all right gang and before we jet um here's my coffee i'm using the bright and mellow stock coffee the yellow one y'all already know the macros three 
um, grant carbs per 12 full ounces. So I put that in my cup. And then I also put in two pumps of this sugar-free vanilla. And then I'm gonna top it off with a Quest vanilla um, protein shake that we will do in the car. I'm about to give y'all some coffee porn. So let me put this top on my cup and then we'll head out the door and I'll see y'all in the car. Good morning, gang. Y'all can officially see my face, y'all. I, um, I typically don't vlog like throughout the week because I always have on like work clothes and stuff and y'all probably would be able to see or kind of know where I work so I just kind of like try to stay away from it that's why obviously if I am vlogging I will blur gotta hold my tripod still if I am vlogging I will blur it dang I thought there was gonna be a red light so I can make my coffee because I told y'all we're doing coffee porn I got a vanilla um Quest protein shake. It's the last one I have in the fridge, y'all. I mean, not in the fridge. I don't keep my um, protein shakes in the fridge because, y'all, I just don't drink them like that. It's very rare that I want a protein shake, so they just be in the closet. I think I got strawberry and creams. I got peanut butter cup. And yeah, I just took the last vanilla. And then also in my closet, y'all know, I got those mini cans of espresso from Starbucks. And y'all, I'm just like... I like things and I like to have the things that I know I like. So now, for instance, I'm, you know, back on keto. Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. Today, a fish, no, Wednesday. I think I started back on keto on Thursday of last week. So tomorrow will be a week back on keto. And it was just so easy. Uh, you know, trying to get this lighting right. It's not right. So yeah, it was just so easy to kind of jump back on track because I, I literally had a lot of stuff already at home. So I just love that for me that um, I kind of keep things in my little, I would say, keto closet or low carb closet. So I have like premier proteins, like I said, um, those little cans of Starbucks and special shots. If y'all remember, I was addicted to those things. But anyway, y'all know my tripod is all crazy. So I'm gonna go ahead and try to attempt coffee pouring. I don't think I'm gonna be able to though because I'm driving. But yeah, here is my coffee. It is the yellow Stoke. When Babe found it that other week, I was in love. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and try. Y'all, this is gonna be a raggedy coffee pouring. But listen, I'm trying to give it to you. My phone is about to fall. Y'all, it's a disaster. Um, I may wait. I may wait. I may wait. <laughs> because I don't want my phone to fall. But um, yeah, so that's like another tip or whatever. If you want to like get back to keto or do whatever, I love to have everything I need like on deck. Meaning if I am. Um, want to go back or if I want to start keto or whatever just eat low carb I already have stuff at the crib so um, if I don't have it and what I usually don't have are like the sweets that I like so as y'all saw I had to pick up my favorite keto cookies from Target and then I picked up some ice cream because I know I like to make my keto like make, uh, chocolate chip it make flurries um, so yeah other than that I try to keep stuff like stocked up because It'll help me out. Just like today, I forgot that I had lettuce in the refrigerator and I was going to um, just go get an iced coffee on my lunch break from McDonald's. And then I was like, well, why would I do that? <laughs> because if I go to McDonald's, um, I'm probably gonna get fries. So that's why I'm happy yesterday. I was, you know, smart enough and in tune enough to know girl get you some tuna and some salad that way you have no choice but to take that so i like when things work out like that so yeah good morning happy wednesday when y'all are seeing this is thursday so friday junior um we're almost there and i'm excited about it <clears throat> i told y'all with the promotion that i got at work i have been training y'all i've been training and i like to train and everything like that but sometimes you know when you train and you can't really focus on what you got to do so then you kind of get behind on what you're supposed to do because you're training and you want to make sure you train well and adequate enough that they will be set up for success yeah so 
I'm training. Like I'm training someone. So, right? Got a promotion and jumped into my duties ASAP. So yeah, with that being said, um, having a good day. Um, I feel really, really good. I have not got on the scale, but this will be like seven days to when you're watching this a week on keto, dirty keto, lazy keto, whatever. Um, but I'm super proud of myself because I also have ate more whole foods this week and I also incorporated, I didn't incorporate any low carb buns or low carb wraps or anything. Like I kept it really basic, just food. So I'm really happy about that. I think I'm gonna keep that up. And like I said, I'm also doing my best to try to close my exercise rings as often as possible. So I'm getting up, making sure I'm moving my body so that I can close my exercise rings. And I'm super excited. Like the not, the month before last, I forgot what happened. My wisdom tooth had to come out. My wisdom teeth had to come out. So I wasn't able to finish my 21 day challenge with Asia Pretty Beauty. Then last month I was on a roll. I was back on track. Everything was good. Then got COVID at the end of it. At the end of the month almost. Well, middle of the month. Beginning of the month. I got COVID on. Well, I found out I had COVID on September 9th. And didn't get back moving or back to work till September 24th. So that literally was like the whole month gone where I wasn't moving with that much or working out. Still lost weight, but it was very unhealthy weight. So this month is October 6th right now. If y'all watching it, it's the 7th. And I feel damn good. I feel good. I'm putting myself out there um, on multiple things. <laughs> I'm killing Blocktober, period. Um, killing it at work. Killing it in the gym. So I'm just very proud of myself. So yeah, that's where we're at right now. Um, and y'all, don't be ashamed to give yourself praise. Don't be ashamed to tell yourself that you're doing a good job. All right, y'all, so I made it to my destination, so I need to hurry up, y'all. Sitting there for like 15 minutes, not drinking my coffee was definitely hard because I was like, I'm gonna wait so I can do coffee porn with y'all, but listen, that's how y'all know I love y'all. So anyway, like I said in the previous clip, y'all saw me put my stock coffee in my cup. I used two pumps, a pump or two of the sugar-free vanilla, and now I'm gonna put in a Quest vanilla protein shake. So I know y'all miss this. I know y'all miss this. I know. Because I did too. Mm. I forgot how good this was. I understood the assignment. And then I'm just going to put the rest of this in here. So it's much more vanilla-y than coffee. Y'all know I would have had to put like a espresso shot or something in here. But anyway, it's good. All right, gang, so I'm going to end the vlog after dinner, um, but I did want to show you guys what we're having for dinner. So, like I told y'all, I'm so proud of myself because I am staying true to my meal plan that I set for myself last, well, over the weekend. And I'm going to keep doing that because it really keeps me on track and it's helping me. So, tonight I said we was doing salmon, broccoli, and cauliflower mash. And then for babe, I added corn and then he'll do mashed potatoes. So let me show y'all what I got. I've never had this CPAC Maury's fine fish and seafood. So this is um, some salmon and I wanted to just try it. I think that it's like fun to try different things. So it looked good. So I was like, okay, let's try it. So these are seasoned um, salmon fillets. So they're in the sink defrosting. And y'all, these are actually pretty big pieces. I'm very surprised. Um, they're big pieces. They are skin on, but um, that's fine. So they're defrosting in the sink. Um, here is some steamable broccoli that we're gonna have. Oh yeah. As far as the salmon, it is only three net carbs per fillet, and it has 27 grams of protein. So that is awesome. There was some um, salmon that I wanted to get from Target, but each piece was like 30 grams, 30 carbs. 
250 calories. I'm like, wait, what's going on? So, um, I'm happy that I found these. And if these are good, then I'll try the other flavors. So, salmon, um, steamable broccoli. I'm going to be having some cauliflower mash. I picked up, well, he picked up the roasted garlic. Um, and then for him, so this is another thing, y'all. This is a cool way to be keto or low carb and then also cook for someone else. Like, Everybody in the household is not going to be keto, it's not going to be on a diet, it's not going to be low carb. So you can still have some of the same things and enjoy the same meal with just a couple differences. So for me, I'm doing a uh, mashed cauliflower. It's seven carbs per serving. A serving is half a cup. So that's awesome. Um, then I also picked picked up some Sunday syrup. This is a sugar-free caramel for desserts, for my coffee. So got that. Got two lemons to squeeze on the salmon. And then like I said, I'm just going to heat these mashed potatoes up for babe. And then I forgot I was vlogging. So I already emptied the can of corn in the pot. So I'm just going to go ahead and cook all this up. Then I'll be back to show y'all. And I'll give y'all a taste test on the salmon when I get back. Cheers. All right, gang, so as y'all can see, it's dinner time. So we have a small filet of salmon right here. I can't wait to taste it. It looks pretty good, but, oh yeah, it looks pretty good. I baked it in the, well, I did it in the air fryer on three, I wanna say 370 for just eight minutes. Y'all know salmon don't take long. Then I put it back in for a minute, so, you know. Dang, y'all, I didn't get a thumbnail. I'm gonna have to fix my fish back. I got some salmon right here, y'all. I got some cheddar broccoli. I just made some broccoli. And the microwave was steamable broccoli. I did a little bit of corn. Corn is definitely not the most keto um, vegetable, but it is 12 grams of carbs per serving. And I literally just got a couple spoonfuls in here. And then I have some cauliflower mash that I just put some cheese on. So this is a dinner. Then, as y'all saw, we just took a shot and I got some Diet Dr. Pepper. So, I'm going to go ahead and eat. This will definitely help me meet my protein today because y'all saw what I had for lunch. I had a salmon pack, um, salmon. I had a, um, Quest Protein. I had tuna, two tuna packets for lunch. And now I'm having this salmon, which is 27 grams of protein per piece. So, yeah. Period. But anyway, I'm about to eat and... Actually, y'all, I'm going to go, well, I may have dessert. So, if I have dessert, I'll show y'all. If not, I'm going to end the vlog. And I'll see you guys tomorrow for day eight of Vlogmas. Like, we already, Vlogtober, we already a weekend. So, I'll see y'all in my next video.